Hi, I'm Struan Robertson. What is fear? What actually is fear? See, we're afraid of spiders, or we might be afraid of flying, and we have fear. Is it possible to experience fear without using your imagination? Is it possible to be afraid of spiders without imagining something? Now, I know that I come from the country of New Zealand where there's no spiders that can hurt you. I've lived in the UK, United Kingdom, where there's no spiders that can hurt you. And, and yet in those countries, people are still afraid of spiders. So therefore, to be afraid of a spider, they must be imagining something that isn't real. You know, people can be afraid of flying, having never ever crashed in an aeroplane, which means they must be on the aeroplane imagining something. And if I'm sitting beside them and I'm not afraid of flying, it means that they must be imagining something that I'm not. We can't experience fear without using our imagination. See, I think fear, spelt F-E-A-R, stands for false evidence appearing real. False evidence appearing real. It's false evidence because we're making it up through our imagination. We imagine that this spider, or there is a spider under my bed and it's going to get me. And it appears very real to me because I'm having a physical reaction. If you watch a movie like an old movie called uh, Arachnophobia about spiders, you can actually sit on the sofa watching the movie and almost imagine the spiders under the seat about to crawl up my legs. Now we know they're not there, but the false evidence is appearing real and I'm experiencing fear. Is there anything in your life that you fear where actually you could change that by just realizing that you're using your imagination? And by changing your focus and thinking of something else, you can remove the fear? Have a go. Be a 10.